Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, Cardi B, child, listen, I don't like talking about this trick because every time I want to talk about her, I feel like I want to gag because Cardi B doing everything but put out a damn album. Like, Cardi, what the hell are you doing now, girl? Okay, so amongst all the things Cardi B has said about black people, once again, she is having a hissy fit because somebody talking about her damn child and she decided to get on the internet and delete her Twitter and her, uh, I'm gonna say her damn YouTube and her damn Instagram because, oh, we, somebody pissed her off. Now, Cardi, we about the same damn age. I don't understand how you letting these hoes on the internet get you messed up and make you want to delete your shit because, girl, why? You are a grown ass woman with two kids and a husband who's allegedly cheating on you all the time. And you worry about these damn comments and shit. Like, girl, tougher skin, you a celebrity bitch. Like, oh my God. You really make your bitches look bad. But check out this live where she explained herself and how she says she ain't taking nothing back. Okay. And shout out my reader for the receipt. Because, girl, uh uh. Girl day shit today, right? And, um, and I'm chilling and everything. And then I'm going to my Twitter fucky fans talking shit like, oh, practically saying that I'm lazy and that I was giving hints that I was going to the Grammys. Bitch, how the fuck was I giving hints that I'm going to the Grammys when I'm literally lasering and bleaching my pussy on my Insta story? Like I literally posted earlier today that in my house in New York with my kids, you could hear my kids in the background. When did I ever gave hints that I was going to the fucking Grammys? And for you to call me lazy and shit because I'm not going to an award. What? Why would I go to an award for? Do I have any new music? Why would I show up with one nomination? And I lost it anyway. So you wanted me to go to the Grammys, lose an award, and me just be there smart like. <laughs> That's great. That's great. Like, come on now, my nigga. Come on now. I don't like that shit. And then it's like, oh, but you was giving out hints. I wasn't giving out hints. What, what, wh how, what in my Insta story gave you hints that I was going to go into the Grammys? Oh, my, my tweet. Oh, I like men that like fashion. What the fuck that got to do with the Grammys? Red hair and tattoos. What the fuck does that got to do with my fuck, with, with, with me saying that I'm going to the Grammys? How is that implying that? So that shit got me mad because it's like, you know, it gets me annoyed when other people talk about me. But when my own fucking fans talk shit about me, that shit really piss the fuck out of me bro that shit really pissed me the fuck off and then because of that that shit that shit had like a domino effect of me just going off and motherfuckers talking about like <laughs> i'm getting canceled this and that let me tell you something i don't give a fuck whatever i said on them tweets i really motherfucking mean it oh why would you wish that on somebody on somebody mother well that person brung up my son if you talking shit about me why are you bringing up my fucking son what do my my son gotta do with anything? If you bring up my son, I hate you. I wish, I wish the worst on you. I wish the worst on your mother, your father, your sister, your everything. I hate you, bitch. I wish your fucking existence fucking disappear of earth because you a dumbass bitch for bringing up my motherfucking son. So okay, next. Am I gonna take that back? What I said about that person, mom? No, cause why would you bring up my fucking son? Why would you bring up my son? Then, then, then another, then, then motherfuckers want to be mad at me because somebody said my child is autistic. My child is not autistic. And y'all love saying that shit on purpose because y'all can't call my kid ugly. You can't say my daughter's ugly because she's gorgeous. So y'all want to put a, a disorder on my child. And there's nothing wrong with that disorder. There's nothing wrong with them because I have, I have, I have friends that have, that have children that are uh, autistic. But my kid doesn't have that. So if I want to say, don't put that shit on my kid, I could say that. Why am I wrong for me saying, don't put that shit on my fucking kid, but, but the person that's tweeting that is not wrong? My child has been getting fucking hate since the day she came out of my fucking pussy. Oh, God, I be wishing I could catch that so I could kill y'all with my own fucking hands. I don't fucking play that shit. And, and this all trickled down for motherfuckers talking shit because I didn't attend that shit. And y'all want me to take it back? I'm not taking nothing back. Suck my dick. Fuck out of here. Shit. 
Why would you bring up my fucking son? And then why would you fucking say some shit about my daughter? And now niggas is mad like, there's nothing wrong with people that have this, this, and that. I never said there was nothing wrong with people that have anything. But don't fucking put that on my kid, bro. Y'all can't find no defect on my child. You cannot say, oh, her eyes is, uh, is this. There's something wrong with her nose. There's something wrong with her lips. There's something wrong with nothing. She's perfect. So y'all just gonna disorder, y'all just gonna put a disorder on her because y'all can't come out with, with shit. And my daughter is super smart. She talks, every, so great, everything, nothing, there's nothing wrong. But y'all hate so much, y'all gotta put some shit on my fucking kids. But then y'all be mad because I'm saying there's nothing wrong on my kid. Don't diagnose my kid with some shit you might have. What is wrong with that? There's nothing wrong with that. Why can't I defend my child? Now Cardi should be canceled. For what? Or you shouldn't wish down somebody's mom, whatever the fuck. I don't give a fuck. Why would you bring up my son? Shit. And that's why I'm upset. I'm upset with fucking everybody, bro. Because I can't even have a good fucking day. I ain't even do shit today. All I did today was get my fucking pussy bleached. And I get on fucking Twitter and, I, and, and motherfuckers calling me all type of lazy and all this and that because I ain't go to the Grammys. For what? Why would I go? And I lost the Grammy. So what the fuck? You, where, where do you want me to go there? To so smile and be like, it's okay. It's okay. I want one next year. I don't have no new music right now. Why would I go? Why would I go? Hmm? Hmm? Tomorrow, I start. Tomorrow, I got to prep. I got to prep today and I got to prep tomorrow. So Tuesday, I'm going far away and fucking finish the motherfucking album. Why would I go? I'm doing a, a, a red carpet soon. It's going to be great. But I don't like when motherfuckers attack me to do some shit and then call me lazy because I'm not doing it. Because one thing I hate is when people call me lazy when I fucking work so motherfucking much. The fuck? And that's why I'm fucking mad, bitch. And like I said, I'm not taking nothing back. Every, every fucking tweet that I made... I motherfucking mean it, bitch. Go send that shit to every motherfucking body. Oh, we sending that everybody to endorse you. I don't give a fuck, bitch. Shit. Go ahead. Send it to them. I don't give a fuck. For the real party gang that love me and support me, I love y'all so much, but some of them got me tight today. And they're the reason why this shit trickled down to the point that I had to fucking delete my Twitter. My fucking stomach hurt. I don't understand. I don't even drink milk anymore. Why my stomach hurt like this? Anyways, um, I said what the fuck I said. And I have a song that I really want to sing to y'all. But I've been a little bit shy to sing. But you know what? Whatever. Singing release my stress. It goes like this. Suck my dick. Yeah, do that. Bye. Well, <laughs> see, you gotta blame black people for Cardi B's antics because we was claiming her as a black woman when she is not. She is Latina. Okay, we've let her go under the radar with all the stuff she said about you know drugging and robbing men and you know wishing uh somebody mama catches AIDS and you know the girl over in Africa that she tried to buy her ticket for that her parents go to a concert where it wasn't selling like Cardi B always is doing some raunchy off the wall shit and because y'all say oh it's cardi b and that's who she is she is she's raw and da, 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 da. we keep letting her slide by now because she's had these damn kids shout out to the kids because they do the wrong it's like anytime cardi uses the i have a kid reference it's like okay we gotta back up because cardi b got kids we do not care not about the kids about cardi b because it's like, when are we going to stop letting Cardi B get away with all the shit she does, okay? You doing your Twitter and your Instagram makes you look childish, little girl. You look childish. Because you knew you were a celebrity. When you became Cardi B the rapper and no longer Cardi B the stripper, you knew what kind of antics you was getting into. You want everybody to baby your bum ass. And quite frankly, bitches is tired of it. You calling your fans stupid and this, that, and the third. But 
all I do is ask you questions. Where's your album, Cardi? Where's the album? We ain't gonna put out new music, Cardi. Where's the music? We ain't gonna stop making excuses about keep getting damn lipo and you keep changing your face like Nicki Minaj. Cardi, we ain't gonna get it together. You said this all stemmed from the fact that your fans thought she was going to the Grammys when your song Up was on there to get a Grammy. You know, you did not get it. All your fans want you to go to show out because everybody stands, Megan stands, and Doja stands, and Scissor stands, and Sweetie stands were all hyping them up. And they're trying to figure out, even though you only had one song, why was Cardi B not in, in, in the room? That's all it was. And you taking this out of the porch because you are a dumb ass. Cardi, I need you to do better. I actually like your music sometimes. And you the personality. I feel like me and you go to club together right now have a great ass time. Because you, you, you seem cool. But like, I can't stand bitches like you. I can't. Like, you really make it hard to like you. Outside of the fact you just shoot Nikki, but that's no conversation of the day. You need to do better, Cardi. Seriously. Because I don't know what they're going to put up your ass. But, girl, it's not all about you, Cardi B. It's not. Grow up. Literally. Grow the hell up. But, anyways, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace.